Hey, so this is just a quick video. Uh, I'm sure anybody that has uh, one of these utility trailers for their ATV in Alaska, we, we refer to it as a meat trailer, <laughs> but can be used for many things. But I'm sure I personally have owned a, a few and have never owned one that didn't do this. And I, anytime I hear somebody driving by, with maybe a few exceptions, all you hear as they go by is clankety clank. You know, because this, It's just slop and it's really easy to fix so we'll give it a shot here I'm just going to show you a quick little deal that I did so I picked up these uh, I ordered these because I couldn't find the right length here in town it's just a patio door stopper the bumper like when you slide your door open bumps up against that keeps it from slamming into the wall in theory came with two uh, these are inch and a half which is what I needed. That was the slop that I had in there to make a nice tight fit. Um, it doesn't have to be that, obviously. You can rubber bumpers for many different things. Automotive parts um, on the back of my toy hauler. When the ramp comes down, there's some nice big rubber bumpers on there. I was thinking about using those, but I couldn't find them thick enough. Uh, I came with these wood screws. I replaced it with a one-inch machine screw. Didn't need anything that long. Pre-drilled it. Um, and then just going to pop it on and pretty simple deal here. Again, just to demonstrate before, and then I'll show you after. You know, you're just driving down the road and announcing yourself. Here you're coming from space. And then I just uh, pre-drilled that already. Obviously, I don't want to... Everybody knows how to drill a hole if you're doing this, I would imagine. And again, I started a, a machine screw in there, one inch long. I know it looks like a big old thing, but there's a big space in there between behind, if you can see in my camera. But behind this, it's recessed quite a bit up under there, so that's why I'm using such a big deal. And again, you don't have to use this specific thing, it's just kind of to plant a seed in your head. So you can. Look at that. It's just that thing bouncing, but that's tight now. That's nice and tight. So I can drive down the road and people won't wonder what, what's coming and what's happening and all that. Anyways, just a quick simple fix. I'm sure um, there's, as they say, a hundred ways to skin a cat. There's thousands of ways probably for people to do this and feel free to share your ideas in the comments. Um, just one quick little thing I came up with and hopefully if uh, that specific thing doesn't work for you, It'll inspire some ideas for yourselves. Thanks for watching.